Well, my name is Riley Stasienko. Uh, I'm an oil painter living in Cincinnati, Ohio. And I'm 22, and I'm a florist for Cincinnati Parks. I work down at Sawyer Point, but mostly I oil paint. I've always been drawing since like I could hold a pencil, but I don't know, there was something about oil painting where I was just like, that feels right, because the paint can get so thick, it's almost like sculpting at a point, and then there's drawing involved, so there's looking at photography, like, Music is a big inspiration too, so it kind of was just like a big melting pot of like all these other mediums I was interested in. This one, I referenced this little section down here from Goya, his witch's flight painting. I just really loved the, the gravity of it, how it just looks like they're catching someone midair. So I wanted to kind of like put my own spin on it, so I put them just like in this big space. It almost looks like it's going underground. And then all of these figures up here are characters that I've had in other paintings before. So it's kind of like they're all like watching, maybe like an arena or something. I've never really been on a motorcycle. My grandpa always rode like old Harleys, so I'd kind of been around them, but not been on them. But it was always like in the back of my mind, that plant of the seed, like one of these days it's gonna grow and I'm gonna get one. And then my buddy Sam, uh, he was like, yo, you gotta like check out this website. You could just customize these bikes and they look like old like 20s, 30s scramblers are sick. And I was like, yeah, that's pretty cool. So then that kind of was simmering in my head for like a few months and I was like, okay, I need to hustle and get me one of these real quick. So then I was like, okay, I'm gonna try to sell a painting for the price of one of these bikes. And then I ended up selling one. And then I got the Janus Halcyon 250 656. I got that back in 2021, and see, so yeah, I put the saddlebags on it, the double seat. Yeah, I got the custom fuel cap with the two Janus heads. Oh, yeah, that was another thing that really sold me on Janus was I was like, okay, like, what's Janus? Like, let me look into this. What's the, what's the lore? <laughs> so then I started like reading about just like the Roman god of beginnings and ends, concrete, like all of that, and I was like, that's really cool. And then I was like, okay, Halcyon time of peace and prosperity and I was like that's a really good concept for a motorcycle company and then recently I got a Oxford plan air painting because I want to strap that to the back of it and just like drive around find cool stuff to paint and it's cool how uh, when you're on a motorcycle like you can pass by like a road that you've probably passed in your car like a hundred times but on a motorcycle you're like why not it's like <laughs> go check it out find a lot of cool stuff like that when you're on riding a motorcycle, you become like a part of the scene instead of just like viewing it. It's like through like a car window, for example, like you're just watching everything go by you almost like a TV. And when you're on a motorcycle, that frame is totally removed. You're just like in the scene. You're noticing things that you wouldn't have noticed before. You feel like the air you can hear outside of what's whatever's going on. Yeah, you can smell things, all the senses are involved. It's like a moment of clarity almost, just kind of like snaps you to the present. You just gotta be super aware. For example, if I'm ever like stuck on a painting, you all go ride my motorcycle and it just kind of like, I don't know, it feels like it, the wind almost like blows the creative blockages out of my head. So that's really nice because then I can come back to the canvas with like a new perspective, new feeling on it. It's like meditation in a way.